Have you ever looked up at a bright, shiny full moon? Have you ever looked up and wished you could fly into outer space? What if you went to the moon? What if you became an astronaut and could fly up to the stars? Imagine sitting in a spaceship, waiting for the thrill of taking off. It's calm and quiet, but your heart will be pounding so loud you can hear it. And now it's time. Will you all help me with the countdown? T minus. Five, four, three, two, one, let's go! a liftoff. Now that we're up in outer space, let's do some exploring. Do you ever count the stars at night? Up here there are thousands more to see, even millions. On Earth we can see them twinkle, but in space they're clearer and brighter and they really put on a show. Of all the stars in the universe, the closest is the sun. It sizzles, brilliant and blazing. We Earthlings are always curious to visit Mars. Do you think we'll find any Martians running around when we get there?
The moon was the first place people ever landed and actually walked around. With so little gravity there, if you weigh 60 pounds here on Earth, you'll only weigh 10 pounds on the moon. You'd be so light, you could bounce up in the air and feel like you're floating. After a vacation to the moon, Mars, the sun, and the stars, now it's time to fly home. On the way back, we'll see a magical outer space view of planet Earth with beautiful blue oceans and green forest and mountains, all laced with silvery white clouds like icing on a cake. Hold on tight for the landing. Oh, 